So now that we've covered a bit on stance, let's talk about grip. Stance supports this upper triangle, but how do we actually engage and hold this gun? Well, let's start with our strong hand. I'm right-handed, so my strong hand is my right hand. I grab the gun so my thumb and forefinger, the flesh in between, is as high as possible. The, uh, this flesh is pressed against the gun high, and then I let my fingers naturally roll to the front portion. At this point here, I don't want to have a rope-like grip, all right? I want to have what I call a C-clamp grip. I learned this from Larry Yatch at Sealed Systems. Instead of gripping the gun like with my fingertips and, and gripping it like I would grip a rope, I think I'm a C-clamp more, all right? Where this front portions of my fingertips, like basically second knuckle region for my size hands, is what's engaging the gun, all right? And you can even see the difference between these grips, because look at my trigger finger, all right? When I have this C-clamp grip, my trigger finger it's, it's remains pretty much steady, uh, independent from, from this squeezing action. When I go rope, the sympathetic neural response is to, is to have a little bit of a hook inward. I don't want my grip to molest or, or otherwise screw up my trigger finger. Okay, so I'm thinking a C-clamp grip. Now I have my weak hand come into play. Now let's just look at this strong hand. I basically am gripping the gun, my thumb is up and relaxed, and I have a little bit of a cavity here, okay? I want to take the flesh of my, the base of my thumb, my finger, and fill that cavity, all right? Now, I'll also cant my wrist as far as it can go while I'm filling this cavity, and then wrap my fingers around the front portion of this gun, okay? What I'm basically achieving here is I have a nice, platform in the rear portion of the gun to take recoil in this portion and I also have a nice engagement of the front portion of the gun to absorb recoil and flip particularly in my ring finger and on down. So when I adopt this grip what I'm achieving is my weak hand, my left hand, has a certain amount of engagement on this left lateral portion of the gun. So my left hand, my weak hand, will actually absorb a lot of the recoil. Now my right hand, of course, just by the nature of my thumb wrapped around, is going to absorb a lot of that recoil as well. The also benefit of this grip is I'm absorbing some of that muzzle flip in the ring fingers of my strong hand as well as my weak hand. As I grip and have a full cant forward, there's a lot of strength behind that gun to mitigate the muzzle flip. The less muzzle flip we have, the easier it is to track those sights, and not just the first shot, but the follow-up shots.